Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Austin. I welcome you to BMF. Stands for Bushmeat Farms. This is West Africa, Nigeria. As you can see, grass cutter is referred in Africa to be bushmeat, and we all know the benefits of eating bushmeat. Today, I'm going to be taking you through the series on how you can actually set up this farm at your home. As you all know that grass cutter feeds on grass. 70% of their feed is grass. That means what you are buying with your money is 30%. That makes it very easy and very simple. The running cost is very low. Okay, people, let me give you a projection within a short time. If you decide to start your farm with 10 colonies, a colony of grass cutter is 70,000 Naira. If you decide to start with 10, that means you are spending 700,000 Naira to acquire the animal. Okay. This projection applies to whether you want to start with 10 or whether you want to start with 5 or you want to start with 2 colony. This is something you can do at the back of your yard. So it's not necessarily means that you must start with 10. But I'm just giving you this projection of 10. Okay, 700,000 Naira. Let's assume you buy 10 colonies at this age. As you can see it. Have you seen it? Okay, this is the size for 3 months old. Okay, as I was saying, by the time you buy them at this age, you really need to stock them in your farm and feed them very well so that they will get matured and get big enough before you put a meal for them. You cross them at age of six months. That means in your farm, they have stayed extra three months. And let me tell you, by the time you cross them, it takes them five months to go through gestation period and let me tell you that grass cutter have their baby in their belly for five months they go through their pregnancy for five months before they deliver and at the end of that five months plus the three months you stock them in your farm to get them matured that gives you eight months at the end of that eight months your 10 colony will deliver and with the experience i've had so far all these years in my grass cutter farming 10 colony definitely will produce 20 colony for you, for sure. That one is guaranteed that at least 20 colony and other meal that will be left behind. Do you understand what I'm saying? So by the time you put up 20 colony that you get from that 10 colony and you multiply them by the amount you bought them, which is 70,000 per one, 70,000 times 20 colony you all know the amount are you getting me this is under eight months and it's expected that you give them some time to breastfeed the animal and then you cross them again at 10th month of that year which is october beginning they give birth probably in august you allow them to breastfeed until october first week you cross them again and let me tell you this time around you are not waiting anymore within five months again from that October 1st. That means by February ending again, your 10 colony again will produce another 20 colonies for you. You can do the multiplication yourself. By the time you times the 20 colony again, times 70,000 each, you know how much it is. Okay, when they give birth by February and you allow them to breastfeed again in the March month, April, maybe ending of April or beginning of May, you cross them again, that gives you another five months. May, June, July, August, September again, and then they give birth. If you multiply another 20 colony by 70,000, my friend, you know how much that will be. This is three times under 21 months. It's a very good business to do. Okay, guys, in my next video, I'll be teaching you how to know when your grass cutter is pregnant. Also, how you can differentiate between the male grass cutter and the female grass cutter as well as what I feed my animal with okay I will also be telling you how you can go about producing this house for them making this concrete house for them so that it will last I advise you not to invest in iron cage because you will definitely lose those iron cage so this is the best housing for grass cutter as I speak to you with experience. Okay, right now I will be signing out. Contact us 
if you want to set up your farm anywhere in Nigeria, even in Africa, all we need is your call. We can come there to advise and mentor you and help you, teach you some things you need to know to have a successful farming and have a profitable grasshopper farming. Grasshopper pays. All you need to do is make up your mind, take our number from your screen and contact us. We can give you this animal. We give you some species among are better than others. So we help you in securing a very good species that you need in grass cutter. As for me now, I sign out from BMF. See you next time. God bless you.